Hey guys, good to see ya. How are Thank you? you? Fine. Good? Good. It's quite good to me. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Very good, man. Very good. So what's new, guys? Ready for your last day here? Yes. <laughs> I am the I am inside because I I, I want to improve my uh, my English. So yes, okay. <laughs> it, it's uh, it, 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 it's it's difficult because uh, when we don't have uh, any person that uh, that that language is English, it's very difficult because everybody uh, talk is the same, uh, same, same me. <laughs> oh, okay. So I got it. I got it. Hold on, guys. I'm gonna send a message. Yeah. Sorry. The word Christmas thinks is vacation today. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> it's free. Hmm. Anyways, guys. Okay, I'm glad to have you here. Um, that's good. You know, it's good that you. Uh, it's good. It's good for you to practice, guys. Okay. Uh, Ricardo, yeah, I mean, um, one thing that I would recommend you, and we're actually going to talk, you know, today, one thing that I will recommend you is to, you know, to, to try to listen to yourself. If you can record audios of, your, of yourself when you're speaking, you know, that that will help you out a lot, okay? So thank you. Mm -hmm. just try to do that uh, so you can, you can improve, you know. Uh, what about you, Veronica? How's everything? Yeah, I need to practice English. Yeah, yeah. I just practice with um with a friend, but I no, it, 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 it not, happens. Not, <laughs> not, uh, it's not the same. Yes. All right, I got you, got you, got you. I'm yeah. trying to talk with my cousin there on on the United States, mm -hmm. but it, but the time is difficult. <laughs> Okay. All right. I, I got you. I got you. All right. Uh, what about you, Jill? Welcome. You I made it. Really you made it till the answer. Hey, I got. I got my guitar back in the background. Right, now. <laughs> in the background. <laughs> right. But now playing. Let's do a. <laughs> let's do a riff off. <laughs> right, let's see who plays better. <laughs> I don't play well, guys. I mean, I play, but it's just you know, like yeah, concert basic, like basic, basic <laughs> stuff. <laughs> I wanted to learn play the guitar, but I can't put my nails in. This is uh, a problem. It, that's not a problem. I mean, it's yeah, okay, that's know. a problem. No, the left not. hand. I left mean, hand. yeah, in the left hand, yes, because you're gonna use the frets, right? But yeah. I mean, as long as they're not that long, you know, it's it's okay. The in the right hand, it's okay, it's good because you know you're gonna you can use your nail to, yeah, to play the strings, you know. But um, but yeah, eat them. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's the problem because I need to to put the the acrylic because oh, it, okay. it, it, this is without acrylic, I beaten my nails but they're not they're not that long you know and like like the length they have right now they would allow you to to play the guitar you know they would still allow you to play the guitar you know <laughs> very good all right ruth welcome back ruth where have you been thank you nice to see you again right how are you thank how was how was your day how was work I am, I am good. All right, all right, very good, very good. Carla, welcome Carla and Michelle, how are you? We're good? So today guys, yes. today, today, you know, today is a happy day, but it's also a kind of sad day, right? Because it's our last day together here, guys. Listen, I, I would, you know, I would pretty much love to be, and, and believe me guys, if I could get the schedule at 8 p.m. again, if I, if I chose, you know, the 8 p.m. schedule, I would still be, have you because because you know if you know the performance is great they get you you know they get you they give you the same people right but I can't have a class at 8 p.m. anymore guys I need to have oh. it at 9 p.m. and that's a problem okay in advanced classes uh, they're only at 8 p.m. so they don't like everything else you know 
uh, well, I haven't seen, you know, like I only, I've only had advanced, um, you know, lately and, um, you know, classes are at 8 p.m. Now I know that 9 p.m. is like for intermediate and basic and things like that. Um, so I'm really yes, not advancing, right. I, uh yeah i don't i don't i don't think we have advanced classes at 9 p.m you know but that that'd be great so you know this is probably you know i don't know all right we're gonna see each other you know at metro center or something one day you know where we might run it you know into each other but other than that here guys we might not right um but yeah guys it's just you know the schedule the 8 p.m schedule is very hard for me on tuesdays okay that's the problem right every other day is okay but on tuesdays it's really hard because i have i have a class so um but yeah guys um so we're gonna go over a couple of things guys all right first the, let's talk about the the completion of the platform all right who has completed the whole platform 100 percent thank you veronica ricardo all right Me? ruth okay michelle thank you ruth <laughs> did, did you complete the platform 100 percent. oh yeah okay yeah. right very good yeah. what, what about you carla only 88 percent okay 88 percent all right but but you finished then you finished i mean did you I'm, I'm not sure if you're talking about the completion the completion of the whole you know of, of all the exercises in the in the platform is 88 percent or are you talking about getting 88 percent in your scores and you completed the the final exam and everything the score all right very good very good okay good job good job all right I need a haircut already, guys. <laughs> yeah. Hi, welcome, Marvin. Uh, hey, that's those are very nice. You know, that's that's a good light you got down there. You got you know you got a <laughs> what is that, Hello, man? <laughs> yes, I, I I put a RGB yes, uh, in your house. <laughs> yeah, let me see. Let me show you that. Hey, that's cool, man. Are you like there's something <laughs> relaxing when you come to the work, right? <laughs> that's the idea <laughs> i okay you should have a party man right oh yeah <laughs> all right very good guys a celebration all right very good guys very good okay anyways guys let's get down to business guys okay again uh thank you now 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 for joining guys uh, uh hi man all right nice to see you again uh michelle carla alexander marvin right thank you for joining in guys all right, guys. So we were talking about um, we were talking about relative pronouns. We we're talking about non-defining clauses. Okay. So what would be the difference, guys, between a relative pronoun, which is, you know, what would be the difference between a relative pronoun, guys, being defining versus one not being defining? We can use uh, relative process. Okay. What is the, what is, you know, there are four things that we make a difference when it comes down to, uh, you know, to, when it comes down to making a difference of relative pronouns, which are defining versus relative pronouns that are non-defined. What would that difference be? What do you think? Non-defining clauses. Uh, we usually define it with between commas. Very good, okay, the comas, guys, the comas, right? And what happens, guys, okay, what what, what do we use? You can reduce the, the undefining clause. Very good, you can reduce it, right? You can, right? Very good, guys, okay, all right, it seems that you got it, right? Now, we saw the examples yesterday, guys, okay, it's time for you to practice, okay, conversation practice. Now, we're going to play a little game, guys, all right? Which is, going to, which is called, you know, talk for a minute without mistakes, okay? So basically, guys, your goal is going to be to practice with a partner, all right? When you practice with your partner, guys, right, you're going to talk about this topic, right? But you have to be able to, you can make mistakes, you know? You can make mistakes when you practice with your partner, right? So first off, you know, practice with your partner, all right? Now here, you know, um, count mistakes okay or you don't need to count mistakes but you need to correct them okay so the problem is that your partner guys right your partner will help you correct mistakes okay all right and number three guys talk for a minute okay 
So during a minute, guys, all right, you're going to be correcting your partner and you're going to be practicing, you know, and then you switch, right? You switch roles. So then your partner is going to take, you know, um, it's going to take the torch, the torch and, 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 and then you're, you're going to switch roles, right? So for example, right, let's see that my partner is, all right, let's see, my partner is Gio, right? Gio, all right. So how were the, 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 the pyramids built? Right. So now here, guys, how were the pyramids built? We're talking about the past, right? And we're talking about is this passive or is this active? How are the pyramids built? The passive, passive voice. It's passive, passive voice, voice, right? Passive Why voice. were they built? Okay, that's passive voice. You know, and 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 Gio can start. Okay, let's start talking, Gio. What what do you think? If you don't know about the topic, guys, go to go to Google, you know, or just make up this story. Okay, it doesn't matter what you say, guys. It matters to me that you don't make mistakes when you're talking. Okay, so Gio, uh, let's go. I think the pyramids were built by <laughs> by aliens, maybe. Okay. <laughs> I think All right, very good. Okay, very good. All right, good job. All right, Gio, very good. Now, uh, that was just an example, Gio. Okay, so see, guys, I caught two mistakes already, right? He said pyramids, which is pyramids, pyramids. right? And he said aliens, which is aliens, okay? So there's, you know, we got two mistakes already, right? I mean, two areas of opportunity, if you want to call it like that, okay? All right, so this is what you're going to do, guys. All right, so this is what you're going to do. Now, Gio is supposed to talk for one minute, okay? Now, if he made mistakes, guys, yeah. your job is to make sure that he doesn't make the mistakes again, okay? All right, I'm gonna be evaluating, guys. I'm gonna be evaluating your grammar, all right? Your pronunciation, all right? Your vocabulary. I'm not gonna be evaluating intonation this time around, guys, because those are free points, pretty much, okay? All right, but these are the areas that I'm going to be evaluating, guys. Grammar, pronunciation, vocabulary, okay? All right, guys, so is it clear, guys? Yeah. All right, then let's yes. get together, guys, and let's rumble. All right, thank you for whoever took this the, the picture before, <laughs> before I got rid of the image, okay? All right, uh, send it to the WhatsApp group, guys, by the way. All right, thank you very much. All right. Let's go, guys. Let's go. Hey, guys. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello. Imagine. Imagine. Yes. Yeah, imagine. Okay, and you take a picture, Carla. Are you ready for? for no, this I one? didn't. I didn't took. Uh, ah, okay. I, I don't know who wants to be the first. I'm looking for the picture. Uh -huh. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Hi. We have uh, to talk about pyramids. Yeah, I think it's the top. Yes. Okay, Carla, go ahead. For me, as I know them as a greatest creation of men, and the at the ancient uh, uh, era, and they we don't know much about pyramids, but they have been built around the the world in thousands of years. I don't think that have to give we have to give credit to aliens or something like that i just guess it's the easiest uh, way to build something to to get high because the um, i don't yeah. know main to, wait 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 to get high <laughs> what do you mean to get ha, high ha, to to hire ah, okay um, place <laughs> about the ground <laughs> oh, okay, right. To, to get guess to a higher guess. position, you mean? To a higher position. Uh -huh. Yeah, I think higher in that uh, in that meaning, right? Is something like when you are a little bit right out of your sense, right, teacher? Higher 
it means okay when when you say you know to get high right to get high means to you know take drugs right because you want to feel you know elevated <laughs> so that, oh, okay that is the meaning of being high okay very good okay continue continue guys all right remember guys remember the whole point right correct your 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 partners okay so we can talk without making a mistake for one minute okay all right very okay. good guys very good have something you know that they are pointing on certain points of the galaxy and yeah. starts yeah and remember guys to correct each other right that's the whole point yeah and okay. and and that that's very interesting because some say they they are energy like energy batteries uh, <laughs> yeah and then they can open portals <laughs> can in the um the america the euro is euro? is uh, it, in, interesting you know, the topic in the pyramids remember guys that the point is so you can i'm sorry for interrupting guys the point is that so you can help your partner with the pronunciation okay uh let me help you right here you said you said euro all right it's not euro it's euro repeat the euro it. is the money yes euro in the country is in, in the continent is european how do you no. say that Europe and Euro. Ah, okay. Right. How do you say bombilla in English? You mean like, you mean like the light bulb? Light, the light bulb. Light bulb. Yes, light bulb. Okay. That's what you said. Light bulb. Okay. Thank you. Okay. okay. All right. Very good, guys. Continue. Okay. In in different places, uh, it's the same knowledge because the for example, the pyramids is construction in different Repeat places. Pyramids, not pyramids. Hi. Pyramids. 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 Okay. Pyramids is is construction in different places. Like in Mexican is different to the Egyptian, but the the shape is similar, right? The shape. Yeah. Okay, very good. Mm -hmm. The shape is similar. And sometimes it's a, it's a, we're used for rituals, rituals, or used. a, excuse me? Used, it's used, not used, it, used. Used for rituals, uh -huh. for, for idols in different cultures, okay. different, Different idols of their humanity. Right. So catch yeah. catch the mistakes, guys. You can write in them. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, check on the other guys. Okay. Good job. Okay. Yeah. So uh, they said that it was impossible that human beings could do that, and I think it's understandable because back then they were not that much, not that many, let's say, instruments like we have now for construction. And mm -hmm. people would do this work by hand. So that's why there are many conspiracy theories. And the reason why they were, were built, I don't know. Maybe they wanted to show off to the rest of the world that they have a very nice infrastructure, I think. But to be honest, I don't think that there have, yes, how do you say it? that word teacher conspiracy conspiracy theories conspiracy theories yes. yes that makes more sense than than thinking uh, about humans being building that so that's my okay. opinion hey you're very fluent michelle very very fluent where, where did you learn your english <laughs> well i have been learning english for almost eight years in different places but I think I'm still struggling with pronunciation, especially with bubble thumbs. Yeah, it's it's probably, you know, it's probably, um, 
I mean, the amount of years, but but I mean, as long as you catch your mistakes, you know, you're going to be able to do it, okay? All right, so uh, continue practicing, guys. Okay. So, what do you think, Ruth? Ruth? Okay, okay. <laughs> Uh, I don't I don't have idea, any idea what and why or where <laughs> they will <laughs> for me it's, I don't I don't know what what I I should say I don't have idea just I I I I see the environment but mm -hmm. <laughs> never I I I ask um never why I ask why they mm, I don't know it's a very popular channel I found a picture about the, this pyramid you know in, in the, the ruins the ruins pyramid the ring, yeah, yeah. The ring, but it's, it's, it's pyramid. It's a pyramid. No, okay, right? Repeat pyramid, not pyramid. Pyramid, pyramid. Pi pyramid. Pyramid. Uh -huh. All right, kind of, right? <laughs> yeah. Continue. Yeah, okay. You, you visited, Carla? I think so. It's San Andres Rings. Ah, ah. San Andres. Uh -huh. I think all pyramids are beautiful and magnificent. They are beautiful uh, buildings. And it's, it's fascinating to think how they build it. We think, we used to think that they didn't have the technology, but they have the, the main goal to finish something. Nowadays, we only start things and didn't finish. So I, I love it. I love to, to see documentals about it. And they have um, many things to talk about. I repeat documentaries. 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 There you go. This is El Tazumal. Tazumal is in Chachuapa. Yeah. Ah, you're looking for the Google? Yeah, yeah, in Google. Yeah, you can look for you. You're looking for the Tazumal, no? On Google, not in Google. On. Right. On, oh, Google. on Google, you know. Every time that you talk no, about technologies, guys, that's on, okay? On the news, on Facebook, on Twitter, on news. Google, on the cell phone, all right? On, all right? You know, it's here. And I, the, Let me see. The Itazumal. Ah, uh, ah, uh, really? Yeah, it's, it's amazing. Uh, it's amazing. Yeah, it's in Chachapa, no? Mm. Okay. I don't know what, what is the alien coming to build. No, <laughs> to, no, maybe, maybe. Came, came to build it, to build this. Maybe to <laughs> Latin, maybe yeah. to this country, not right. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, but you think there are real or exist? What what? UFO? Uh, U F O, right? No, I, I don't know. No, do do you think? Mm, or you didn't see a documentary and some? Uh, information to uh, to to go out to the uh, Michelle, Michelle, Michelle. I'm sorry. What happened to Ruth? Did she lose uh, connectivity? She, she lost the connectivity. I think. Okay. All right. Very good. Uh, we're we're gonna go back in just uh, two minutes. All right. I'm sorry. Uh, so you've been learning English for seven years already. Yes. All right.
that's that's what you have that next do you do, do you dedicate to something where you have to practice your english every day i'm a teacher oh you're a teacher <laughs> yes. oh where do you teach at i'm teaching in a public school now but it's in a what school formal. it's a public school here in lourdes called canton el capulín oh okay yeah i used to live in lourdes oh well, not lourdes lourdes but nearby hey that's crazy that's cool you know all right yes, no wonder yes. why you're very fluent yes and also because i had um that passion to learn grammar so right. i love to learn topics about it and sometimes i know them but i kind of confuse them with different ones or i have a different let's say rule that i make up right <laughs> right no yes. but but your but but your level is very advanced right it is it is advanced english okay um it, you you i don't know uh you know you tend to get fluent with you know as your right. as years pass by right um there are minor mistakes you know we we still make like we learn i don't think that you know we stop learning a language not even in spanish nor not even in our you know native tongue right we still learn things um but yeah you're good you know you sound good you you're very understandable and uh you're doing great okay but yeah i was wondering you know where you learned your English because it's, you know, it's very advanced compared to the ones who, um, you know, compared in comparison, you know, it's just a little bit more advanced, right, than, than the rest so far. Right? But hey, I didn't know that. I didn't know that you 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 taught English. Yes. I'm sorry. What do you? I took this course. Yes, I took this course because I felt that I wasn't having enough practice. I wasn't um, talking a lot at home. So I okay. decided to take this course. All right. Did, did, did you learn something new here? Yes, um, because sometimes I learned it. Well, I used to study a lot um, back in the days that I was at the university. But now to, uh, let's say, go back to those topics, it reminds me or it brings back all these uh, things that I had learned before. It's like it activates what I, I already know. Oh, so that's nice. It's interesting, yes. Because sometimes we forget words or we learn new expressions and those things are helpful when you're okay. a teacher. Did you, did you know the grammar topics that you've seen in this uh, course so far? Mm -hmm. You knew them already? Did, uh, yes, I work in the platform, let's see. I think I get to 100 in one week, but I didn't say anything. Oh, okay. <laughs> all right. That's cool. Okay, that's cool. All right, we're going to go back now. Uh, okay. We're going to have a little practice and then um, and then we'll have fun. Okay, thank you. Thank you for, you know, sharing with me, Michelle. All right, we're going to go back now. All right, guys, thank you for being here. All right. So, um, all right, guys, so uh, let's go ahead and, and do the evaluation, the evaluation, guys. Uh, I want to teach you something that's very important. It's not part of uh, the platform, but it's good for your pronunciation, okay? I want to, um, I want to teach you this first, okay? Before we evaluate you, all right? which is, I don't know why guys, schools and universities don't really teach this, but it's extremely like absolutely 100% important, okay? So before guys, we uh, before I evaluate you, all right, I'm gonna go ahead guys and uh, teach you about vowel sounds, okay? All right, now in English guys, we have, oops, I'm sorry. All right, so in English guys, we have, we don't have five vowel sounds, okay? We have 14 if we take into consideration diphthongs, you know, and we have even more if we consider diphthongs, okay? But in reality, guys, how many do you see here? Three times four, that's 12 sounds, right? We have 12, 12 vowel sounds, okay? Now, guys, now that you're gonna practice this, okay? I want you to understand, guys, that in English, it's not, you know, this word right here, right? 
How will you how would you read this? Okay, I want let's see, guys. I want someone to read this for me, okay? Let me actually this, okay? Here. How will you read that? Um, let's see, Ricardo. Uh, let me keep your package. package. Okay, this is what you said, okay? I, I, I mean, I don't care about everything else right now, guys. Anything else, I'm sorry, all right? But you said this, okay? This is what you said, okay? It's okay, right? It's okay, Ricardo, all right? Uh, Carla, how will you read this? Let me keep your package. Okay, you said this, okay? You said that's, that, that's the consonant, it was even different. Okay, good job, Carla. All right, uh, Gio, how will you read this? Uh, <clears throat> let me check your package. All right, you said this again, okay? Actually, no, you kind of said this, okay? All right, uh, Jaime, how do you how do you read that? Sorry, sorry, when in mute. Uh, let me check your package. All right, very good. You said this, okay? All right, uh, Veronica, how do you read this? Let me ship your package. Okay, you said this too, okay? All right, <laughs> it's right. Michelle, how do you read this? Uh, let me ship your package. Okay, you also said this, okay? <laughs> It's okay, guys, right? It's right, right? So if you ever got it, it also says this, okay? All right, uh, Marvin, how do you read this? Let me, let me ship your package. Okay, all right, you also said this, okay? All right, guys, so everybody said, guys, déjeme oveja su paquete, all right? <laughs> That's what you said, guys. Okay, déjeme oveja su paquete, right? So now, guys, this is the difference. You know, if you want to sound more American, guys, or actually not American, guys, English. You know, if you want to talk in English in general, general, you know, this is a big difference. Okay, these are called the vowel sounds in English. Okay, so the one that you produce, the one we produce in Spanish, guys, it's called. It has two names, okay? All right. It's they're called tense vowel sounds, or you can call them long vowel sounds, okay? They are called tense vowel sounds, guys, because try to say e and feel your muscles, guys. Feel 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 your you know the muscles within your mouth. E right? E that's how you pronounce the e in Spanish. Right, you feel, don't you feel a, a slight vibration guys around your, like your, your, um, your nostrils and also like the top of your, the roof of your mouth, n -n 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 -n, that e, e, everybody say e, e, right? Try, pronounce it guys, okay, come on, all right? You have to pronounce it so you can understand this, okay? E, all right, now, now check this out guys. I want you guys to to think, you know, you had a very, very long day. You're very tired, you know. You went to sleep, then you woke up, and all of a sudden, guys, you feel like, you know, somebody wakes you up, guys, okay? How do you feel, guys? If How would you feel, guys, if, oh, you know what? A good example would be the, the shake that we had yesterday. Did you feel it? We had a shake yesterday, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. All right, so, all right, how do you feel, guys, when, when something, you know, like you're, you have this, um, you're sleeping guys, okay? You're, you're sleeping because you're very tired, okay? And then all of a sudden you get something like that. All right, and you're like, eh, eh. Everybody do this, okay? Eh, 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 eh. Uh, eh. All right, it's, uh, it sounds funny guys, it sounds funny, but, but those are the short vowels and they're not really complicated guys. People can explain this, okay? But if you think about it, it's just when you go like this. All 
when you go like very lazy, guys. Now the 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 uh, the short those are called the short vowel sounds. Okay, so we got ten vowel sounds. Actually, let me share the screen here, guys. Okay. So, anyways, okay. So we have the ten vowel sounds, and these are long or short, guys. Long. These are long, right? These are called long vowel sounds, right? And then we have we have what? We have the where's the format here? All right. And then we have the lax vowel sounds, okay? They're called lax, guys, because of you relax your muscles, okay? And these are the short vowel sounds, okay? All right, these are short, guys, okay? Now, I want you to put to put this into practice, guys, when you are pronunciating, okay? Now, guys, so listen, okay? I'm going to give you one example here. All right, let's talk about, you know, let's talk about a long one, guys, okay? All right, when you say sheep, all right, versus ship. Notice, guys, what happens here, guys? All right, when you pronounce sheep, which is the one that we pronounce in Spanish, okay, you tense your muscles, okay? Sheep. Notice, e, sheep. Oh, that's a sheep, e, right? It's harder for you to pronounce it. But let's pretend that you're all lazy, guys, that you don't care about anything in the world, okay? You are like, ship, 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 eh, 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 huh? What? I didn't hear you, right? Eh? Repeat, guys. Eh, 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 eh. eh. That, that E sound, right? Now, it's called a short sound, guys, but you can extend it, right? You can say, eh, 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 okay? Now, there's sheep. And now you're going to notice the difference between sheep and ship. See? Ship. Ship. Sure. Doesn't it? Sure. Eh, eh, I don't care, right? I don't care about you, right? Eh, sure. eh, eh. See? A, ah, E, eh, E, O, U, E, 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 E. That A, eh, guys. Sure. That A, eh, when you're very lazy, guys, that's a short or a lax vowel sound because when you pronounce it, guys, don't you feel like it's more relaxing, guys? You know, the sound, guys. Mm -hmm. Try to pronounce A, eh, A, eh, A. Eh. You could be sleeping, guys. See? Eh, 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 right? But the other one, guys, you have to say E, right? E, and that is more tense. Got it? So yes. the pronunciation for this, guys, is not ship. Let me ship your package. No, that's not it. Let me ship your package. No, let me ship. Let me ship. Not let me ship. Let me ship. Guys. Sheep, let me right? Sheep, ship. Sheep, ship. Sheep, ship. Ship. Right. Yeah. All right. It's not an A either, guys. Okay, it's a, it's a, it's just remember, just relax, you know, relax your your, your throat, right? Ship. Oh, let me ship your package, sir. Ship. Ship. That's why, guys, you know, ship. that's what when I say let me ship your package sounds better than let me ship your package. Imagine, a, um, imagine you know someone from America, guys, saying let me ship your package, right? It doesn't sound, guys, like something you know some a native speaker would say, right? So anyways, guys, okay, these are, this is the lax vowel sound, see? Another example, guys, here. I'm just talking about one vowel, guys, but there is another example here, okay? When you pronounce these two words, okay? So how do you pronounce the first one? Now that you know, guys, Gio, how do you pronounce the first one? This. Very good, this, see? Very good, very relaxed, eh, 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 all right, very good, eh. All right, how do you pronounce the second one, Gio? These. These, okay, these, this. These, this, these, this, these, this, got it? All right, so it's a relaxed, it's a relaxed sound, right? Very good, guys, so going back, guys, to the vowel sounds, okay? All right, now that you know that we don't have only five of them, okay? We have, here we have 12, okay? So notice, guys, okay? How do you, now, how do you pronounce, how would you say, let me ship your package, guys? All right, let me hear you. Um, let's see, Alexander, how would you say, let me ship your package? Is it, let me ship your package or let me ship your package? package. All right, very good. All right, Veronica, let me how ship. Is, let me ship, ship, right, ship. ship. Let me ship, ship your package, sir. All right. Yes, long, long, long. All right, very good. Uh, how would you pronounce it, Veronica? 
Let your packages. Oh, how you pronounce it? Let me shape your Now shape, package. shape. Let me shape your shape. package. Shape your package. Very good, okay. Michelle, how will you pronounce it, Michelle? Um, let me shape your package. Very good, that's the right pronunciation. Good job, guys, okay? Now notice, guys, I'm not gonna give you a full class on this because this would take this would take at least you know four hours, guys. If I were to, if you would if you were to understand it, and it would take like years for you to master it. All right, but I want you to notice, guys. Okay, the ones that we pronounce in Spanish are this, you know, uh, are, well are are these ones, right? Um, so we got sheep. We got the u. We got the regular e, right? We got the o sound right here, all right? Now, guys. Uh, I'm not going to go over these ones, guys, but I do want you guys to notice this, okay? All right, this one and this one, guys, that's an A sound. But what is the difference, guys? This is how we pronounce cat. Repeat, guys, cat. 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 All right. Cat. What happens here, guys, when you're pronouncing cat, all right, cat. you smile. Cat. See, cat. Oh, that's my cat, man. Man. All right, see, man, cat. Right? You have to smile when you pronounce that, right? It's what that this is the reason why it's called a banana sound because you have to smile, right? You have to make a banana shape with your mouth, right? Cat. Oh, dude, this is my this is my cat. I introduced you to my cat. See? Now, guys, what happens with this other ah sound? Okay. This is when you go, like when you go to the doctor, guys. What happens when you go to the doctor? What do they ask you to do? They ask yeah. you to oh. open your mouth and say, ah, oh, ah, oh. okay. Oh, yeah. So this is how do you pronounce bar. this? How bar. how do you pronounce this, guys? Car. See, it's not car, bar. guys. Car sounds like Sofia Vergara. Now bar. try to pronounce it with the doctor sound. Car. Oh, that's bar. my car. That's my car, bar. man. That's bar. my car. You dropped bar. your jaw, guys. Okay. That's my bar. car. Bar. All right. How do you pronounce it, Michelle? Car. All right. Car. Not bar. car, guys. Car. See. See, take a look. At, take a look at the shape of my mouth, guys. It doesn't go like car. Right? It goes down, right? The 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 jaw, guys, drops, right? Car. Well, that's my car. That's my father. That's my car. Right. Anyways, guys. Okay. So this is a little bit about vowel sounds, guys. Remember, we have twelve of them. If you want to learn how to pronounce, you can go, guys. There are some certain certain websites, guys, which they're gonna show you these symbols. Okay. These symbols, guys, represent these are the phonetic symbols, okay? They represent how, how a sound is pronounced, okay? See, all of these, got it? That is a, the visual representation of how something sounds, and this applies to any language, by the way, all right? Got it? All right, sorry, guys, I'm not going to give you a full yes. class on that, but it's important to know because I'm going to evaluate you right now, and... Um, and I want you to, you know, to, to practice, you know, at least practice the E sound, okay? The A, okay? The short A versus the long one. The, what determines, guys, by the way, what determines, you know, what sound you're going to make is the consonant that follows that, that vowel, okay? Anyway, so who wants to go first, guys? All right, Gio, let's go, Gio. All right, you got one minute, man. All right. Hey, you're always the first. It's because you're you're the first one in my like from from my end, you know, you're the first person okay. I see here. I'm gonna put the timer. All right. Oh, okay. You you get the timer. Yeah. That'll be great. Yeah. Okay. okay. I get it. Okay. Um. Okay. And for, for the first, I I think that. The, the the pyramid were built by humans but uh, ha they had the knowledge from aliens because um, in the first place uh, we know that that they are mortuary cameras but the form that that the pyramid uh, is 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 it represents like like the rays of the sun of the light of the sunlight and and they are aligned 
in some ways that represent the the stars in and maybe they have some connection with them and that's it <laughs> good job plus for Gio, guys good job all right good job Gio, right good job man right you you made less you know mistakes than last than, than last time right uh we're gonna probably guys because you know um because of the time we're gonna i want everybody to participate so we're gonna shorten it up to uh to 30 seconds okay so 30 seconds without making mistakes so if you can you know try to try to uh change that geo all right set the timer for 30 seconds oh, instead okay. of one minute okay? okay all right okay. very good so now let's talk about your feedback here okay uh you said by human instead of by humans the thing what happens here guys okay i know that and and this is from experience i know that you know that you don't say by human you say by humans right but what happens guys is that it's more about focusing on what you're saying. You have to listen to yourself because, you know, it was built by humans, right? Not by human, right? It needs to be plural because it was multiple, you know, it was, it was multiple human beings mm -hmm. building those pyramids, okay? Then you said mortuary cameras. I didn't understand this. Mortuary cameras. Oh, mortuary cameras. Yeah. Okay. Like this mortuary camera. Okay, yeah. right, yeah. very good, okay. Uh, then you say it represent, right? And it's not, it, it represent, it's it. Third, per, third person, guys. It represents, Represent. okay, all right. So here there is a problem with the subject and verb agreement, okay? But again, I don't think it's a, it's a problem with a subject verb agreement. It's actually a problem with the third person, okay? I mean, not the third person, just focusing, right? They say they are aligned. Uh, this is a very common uh, problem, guys, from Spanish speakers, right? The pronunciation should have been, they are aligned, okay? Da, 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 at the end. That, that sound, guys, needs, you need to pronounce those final sounds, okay? Other than that, it was beautiful, Gio. Good job, all right? One applause for Gio, guys. Good job, Gio. Next one I see here, guys, is Jaime. All right, Jaime. Let's go. Jaime, you okay. got 30 seconds on three, two, one. Let's go, Jaime. Now. First of all, for me, that the, the pyramid uh, was built by indigenous settlement was they need to, I don't know, to use this for uh, have a meeting, important meeting, important uh, I don't know, situation that they need to to represent uh, in the in the settlement settlement in the you know and then they use for for different uses in indigenous indigenous settlement settlement all right and i think the 30 seconds is up now Gio, did you you gotta say no. stuff right you gotta say stuff Gio. <laughs> no what's the minute no Right. No, what? 30 seconds, 30 seconds. Ah, 30 30 seconds. seconds. Ah, yeah. Very good. Yeah. Applause for Jaime, guys. Good job, Jaime. I thought it was uh, a minute. Uh, no, it's okay. It's all right. Uh, but thank you very much, sir. Uh, all right, Jaime. All right. Um, it's 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 very nice, Jaime, that you're very outspoken, you know, and because uh, you don't, you know, you, you, you actually talk a lot, okay? And that's very good. One of the things, guys, that will help you improve at any language is that you're not you're not afraid of speaking okay so that's very good now what i recommend you jaime is to practice you need to practice the vowel sounds okay and also there is a big problem here pronouncing the final consonant sounds okay you say was bill i don't know what was bill was uh oh you meant built see yeah, there's there is a t at the end you said it was bill all right and also built. the pronunciation is built Right, it, I built. All right, then you say in uh, in the indigenous or indigenous or something like that. It's indigenous. Um, and they say sacrament. I think they, they, settlement. Oh, they, okay, settlement. Repeat settlement. 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 All right, a settlement. Okay. Uh, then you need to pronounce that T at the end too. Okay. Settlement. All right. Uh, oh. Although, you know, you talk a lot, but the order of ideas, you know, you need to structure your sentences, right? Because otherwise it is very, 
it's not really understandable, but you know, I, we can understand you, I think, um, because of, uh, we speak Spanish too, right? But you need to order, you know, the ideas first, right? You say situation, right? It's not situation, it's situation. Repeat, situation. All right. Uh, then you say settlement again, indigenous. Uh, then, then you say they use for different uses, right? So what happens here, uh, Jaime, this is a common mistake, not only from you, but you know, from whoever is speaking, you know, is trying to learn English from for the first time, is um, the, the final consonants, okay? You have to focus on the final consonants. So what you, what you can do, you know, listen to yourself, right? Just listen to yourself when you're speaking and say, you know, oh, I'm gonna correct myself, okay? Instead of was built, say was built, right? Uh, so that's what you have to do. You know, you can record yourself if you want, all right? But overall, very good job, okay? Plus for Jaime, guys. Good job, Jaime. All right, very good. All right, then we got Ricardo. All right, Ricardo, let's go. 30 seconds, Mr. Gio. And let's go with Ricardo. Okay. I think the, okay. Uh, I think the, the pyramid was built uh, when the smart person because there are uh, many things, interesting uh, things uh, for uh, uh, the form uh, of the pyramid uh, was built. And then the purpose, I think this is, uh, um, it, it's, it's, uh, it's, it was a uh, um, resurrection, I think the resurrection uh, wow. to, 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 to get come back to All right, life. good job. All right, good job. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, Ricardo, guys. Good job, Ricardo. All right, very good, Ricardo. So, same thing here. All right, you, you talk a lot. You, you try to, you know, come out with your ideas before the structure can be processed, okay? So, the structure needs to be processed in your brain first, you know, before, you know, the ideas come out. All right, uh, so we, we still have, you know, pronunciation mistakes with final consonants. Again, the final consonants, right? You say I think, and also the, the E sound, right? That's the wrong E sound. It should be I think. See, I think. I Repeat, think. I think. I think. Not think, think. It's, yeah, I it's think. like A, A, A. Remember A, uh, right? I, I think. think. I think. Okay. Very good. All right, that's more like, okay? Then you say pyramid, it's pyramid. Pear, pyramid. Pyramid, okay? Pyramid. Right? They said there are, there are, all right, this there are, right, this R right here is not a T, guys, okay? It's not, it's not a, an R in Spanish. There are, okay? That's how you pronounce it, there are. Yeah. But yeah. I know, guys, it's difficult. I don't know why it's difficult, but but every class that I've had, guys, people say there are, all right? But it's not there are, it's there are. There are. There yeah. are. Yeah. There are, okay? Yeah. Yeah. Then you yeah. say many things interesting, many interesting things that the adjective goes before the noun and also the noun should be a plural right so you should have said many interesting things right so that's how it is the, the adjective before the noun all right for the pyr pyramid right uh then that's the order of ideas again that's you know structuring what you're saying right the order the order of ideas in general okay so again what how you can improve guys okay listen there there are two ways guys okay all right, you can talk to people, you know, and try to imitate them, or you can listen to yourselves and try to correct your mistakes, okay? Yourselves, okay? Um, but one thing that you have to know, all right, if you see, guys, you know, a final consonant, try to pronounce it. There are ways, guys, where we don't pronounce the final consonant, which is called, you know, that we call those liaisons, okay? Or connected speech, okay? However, guys, these right here, all right, I'm not going to teach you that, okay? But uh, but in some scenarios, guys, you actually do pronounce them. Okay, it's not that you don't pronounce them; it's just that they are joined with another consonant sound. Okay, but good job overall, Ricardo. Okay, good job, Blue, for Ricardo, guys. Good, thank good, you, good thank job. you, thank you. <laughs> All right, then uh, let's see, guys. Who'd like to go next, guys? Because I don't think we're gonna have time for everybody. Who'd like to 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 do it? Who'd like to go ahead, Veronica? Thank you, Veronica. Ooh, Veronica. All right, good job. All right, 30 seconds, Mr. Gio. Okay, three, two, one, now. Okay, the, I think the pyramids is an interesting topic to talk because uh, I think that the ancient people know uh, different things that in this time we didn't know. And for example, 
uh, they know about gravity and other topics and the university, maybe the uh, um, alliance uh, with the metals or all the things, it works to the right. stones. All right, very yeah. good, good job, good job, Veronica. All right, now in your case, Veronica, you do have a good order of ideas, right? All right, what we need to work on again uh, would be the pronunciation of words, right? It's not pyramids, it's pyramids. All right. Yeah. All right, and you know that, but you know, you need to focus, right? They say the ancient people, uh, you, you may probably know ancient people, right? There is ancient. that. You, yes, ancient, ancient. Yes, ancient people, right? You need to pronounce that ta 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 sound at the end, right? The ancient people, ancient, all right? Uh, now this is this is I've heard you this multiple times, guys. Uh, I'm not not you guys, uh, Veronica. You say different things, okay? Difference. This is a noun, okay? Huh? The adjective. What is the adjective, guys? Different. Different oh. with a t at the end, okay? Okay. Different. You say different things, okay? Okay. All right. So that is the adjective, okay? So be careful with that. It's not different things, okay? They know, you said they know. They, they I think that you, you meant they know. They right? know. All right, it's no, okay? You need to pronounce that ooh at the end, right? They know. No, they okay? know. All right, mm -hmm. and you say and other topics. Another very common mistake from Spanish speakers, guys, this is a TH sound, okay? You say they, not, I mean, do you say, I'm sorry. You say other, not other, other. Repeat other. 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 Okay. That, 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 that. All right. Very good. Uh, then you say, well, then that's it. Okay. Uh, aside from that, you know, great order of ideas. Um, good job. All right. Plus for Veronica, guys. Good job, Veronica. All right. Thank you. <laughs> Excellent, guys. Okay. Um, so, anyways, guys, um, you know, next module, guys, uh, will be, a, you know, you're going to be in advanced three. One thing that I will recommend you there is just, um, you know, practice, guys. I don't know. It, it depends on whatever your, your goal is, right? If your goal is to speak correctly, all right, study, guys. Study vowel sounds because I haven't seen, you know, I haven't seen universities teaching this. I don't know why, guys. All right, from, from, from Spanish, perfect. they teach these at linguistics, guys. Okay. Um, but it's something, guys, that, that you do need to learn. And the reason why is because you, you, you so if you notice, guys, you were pronouncing sheep as, as I mean, you were pronouncing ship as sheep, right? And it is a very different sound, right? I can recognize it, you know, uh, very different, right? When you say full versus when you say full, see, that's another sound, right? Full, I'm um, full, man. You're, you're uh, I'm full, right? My stomach's full, man. My stomach's full, 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 right? Versus my stomach is, my stomach is full, right? Un tonto, right? Fool. You're such a fool, man. All right. See, that's a different sound, right? Or wait, when you pronounce car, right? And cat, see? You don't say caught, caught, right? You don't say caught. Oh, look at my caught, <laughs> right? But you do say, look at my car, right? Right? So, uh, hey, he's my father instead of he's my father. Right, nobody says he's my father. See, it's a different accent, guys. Ah, oh, ah, uh, right. So, anyways, um, that's all I wanted to share with you guys. Uh, thank you guys for having completed the platform at 100. percent All right, most of you, or having you know completed the platform in general, right? Uh, it's been a pleasure, guys. It's been a pleasure meeting you, and uh, you guys are very responsible. I really like that, to be honest. All right, um, a very dynamic class, guys. All right. Gio, nice meeting you. Jaime, nice Veronica, you. Carla, Ricardo, Marvin, Alexander, and Michelle. You guys are awesome. And I hope to see you around someday, guys. Okay. With this, I don't know if you have anything to say. Otherwise, you know, uh, I guess, you know, you should say goodbye to each other and everything. Maybe you will see me next module, right? I hope. But uh, yeah, guys, it's, um, it's a goodbye from me, guys. And it's been a pleasure. If you want to. Yeah. Thank you. Say goodbye to your partners. Take your time right now. <laughs> you like... Thank you, teacher. You're gonna be Thank you, touch. teacher, for your right. for your time. Yeah. Right. All right. No, thanks to you guys. Yeah. Thanks to you. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.
<laughs> All right, guys. So um, good job, guys. And thank you very much for everything. Okay. Have a very nice day. And happy holidays, okay? Take, Take care, care of yourselves. Thank, thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you so much. Bye. Bye, guys. Bye, Carla.